There's a great promise with stem cells and promoting tissue regeneration, but most of them die. So we think, how can we create an environment where those stem cells will survive? And these are in applications of stroke, or spinal cord injury, or even blindness. And what all of these uh, diseases share in common is that there's no way to promote regeneration in the brain right now. But we know the brain can regenerate, but we don't know how to take advantage of the regenerative capacity of the brain. So what we do is think about what type of environment can we create for the stem cells so that they do survive after we've transplanted in the brain. One of the big challenges in stem cell biology is also having enough stem cells, so having a sufficient supply. So really thinking about that as manufacturing, cell manufacturing. Some of these materials that we've developed, they're hydrogels, just water swollen materials, have some really interesting therapeutic benefit on them by themselves. So those are actually really exciting and from a commercial perspective, something that we can accomplish in the shorter term. I think of our lab as applied chemistry and applied biology. So we really have the applications in mind and those applications are all medical applications. The opportunities are fantastic.